Hello Hornet readers, Miss Harrison here to share with you another book that I read this summer. This one is called Made, Hard Work, Low Pay, and a Mother's Will to Survive by Stephanie Land. This is definitely an upper school book. It is nonfiction, so it is a true story, um, kind of part memoir, part um, factual information. Um, in the book, Stephanie Land uh, finds herself at 28, not having gone to college, um, pregnant she marries the man who she has a child with and they last for a little bit but then he becomes abusive and so they get divorced and she takes the child with her and she's having trouble um, finding work that will accommodate having a child um, and so she ends up taking a job as a maid and so this book is about her story about working as a maid and what it's like to go into other people's homes and how uh, people treat you when you are for hire, if that makes sense, but also how very difficult it is when you are part of the working poor class to ever get ahead. So she talks a lot about how if she got a promotion and made too much money, then her child care money that the state or that the country provided for her then would get dropped. She talks a lot about insurance and f having trouble finding a place to live that doesn't give her daughter breathing issues because a lot of uh, the places that she found had mold in them or things like that. And then her daughter would get sick and then she'd have to take her to the doctor and she'd have to miss work. And all of these things just sort of kept building up and building up. And ultimately, she always had um, a desire and a passion to be a writer. That's what she really wanted to do with her life. And so this is her struggle trying to um, keep a job, keep her daughter uh, fed and in care and make her way to university so she could study writing, even though... Um, you know, she was having this trouble with just trying to keep things going at home. So um, I enjoyed it quite a bit. It's a lot of information that some of it I was aware of, some of it not. But it's really interesting to think about uh, the people who come into your home and help out with things. Um, and again, sort of another uh, commentary on how difficult it is for people who live paycheck to paycheck to ever quite get ahead and that the help that they receive from the government um, sometimes helps just keep them in that spot and never helps them get ahead. So um, if you want to check out what it's like to be a maid or hear a really inspirational story about a person who um, took herself to the university and made it all happen and became a writer, you want to check out Maid at the library.